Hey, how's it going, everybody? Zombie back with another video for you guys today. This one is on the Vapid Click Wagon. It is a definitely a unique one. It kind of reminds me of a, a book I read once, but it honestly I don't want to bore y'all with the details. I can't even fucking remember the name of the movie either way. So, eh, whatever. Um, it has a very weird wooden finish, and I. Don't know how I feel about that. Um, but we're starting here in the garage today because uh, it is dark outside. And I, I'm trying to progress the... Uh, get rid of the inevitable of it getting dark. It is becoming dark outside. That's a, that's a better way to put it. But to start out, we're going to go ahead and show off how much it costs and where you can get it. It is here in southern San Andreas or if you go to travel and transport. You can clearly go all the way down to Southern San Andreas Super Autos. It is right here and it is part of the San Andreas Mercenaries DLC. Oh my god, my fucking brain just fucking died there. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, it is right there. Um, it is 1.205 million. I, I don't know why I make it like that in the million category, but you know, whatever. Um... Oh my god, why am I yawning? I, it is, I have not been up that long, I'll be honest. <laughs> um, but here we go, we're going to go ahead and hop right in and we are going to... This is supposed to be a muscle? That did not sound very muscly, that's a little weird. But yeah, you guys can see how late it is in the fucking day and game. I, I tried to prolong it, I tried to prolong the inevitable, but god damn it. Uh, what, what is this in our real life? Um... Where is the thingy? I ha I have notes on this already, guys. I, I apologize. I'm just not ready for this. I I literally I literally had the note up and then my phone turned off. All that shit. But this is a shut up, Martin. This thing is based on a 1951 Ford Country Squire. I think is really. Why does everything happen whenever I'm making a video? Like, God damn it, man. <laughs> but, yeah, this is uh, based on a 1951 Ford Country Squire. Like, uh, one of those dudes that would, that would uh, serve under a king. Like, you'd hear a king say, Squire! Or some shit. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. But it is another Ford product, and I, of course, have to do all the Ford products in the game because I'm a Ford person in general. Um, I actually just got approved for a vehicle today, so I'm excited. I don't know what I'm getting yet. I have, I have some ideas, but I was approved for a vehicle. Um, of course, loan-wise, you know, some people have to take loans for cars, but, you know... That's just how it is. Everybody has to pay off a loan for a car eventually. Unless you just buy your vehicles outright, then you're just lucky and need to do it. Then you don't need to worry about what I'm talking about. But we're going to go ahead and show the inside. Pretty cool looking, just standard, standard wooden little station wagon, you know. But this thing has 23 customizations. We're going to go ahead and knock out the basics. Oh my gosh, hiccups. Please go away, hiccups. Okay, so, um, bumper-wise, um, I always like the bu the bullet bumper. It just looks great, man. Um, we're gonna do bullet bumper on the back, too, just because I like the bullet bumper. Um, we got the EMS upgrade. Oh, we got some exhaust options here. Um, we got the titanium tipped. We have the adenized, anodized? I, I'm not sure how to say that. Um, I'm fucking dumb, you know? It's all about that Florida education, you know? F Florida, Georgia education, you know? <laughs> I gotta make fun of myself at least a little bit, you know? That's a weird one. I'm just gonna do the wide chrome tip because that looks the greatest, and it's not gonna make me look like a complete fucking retard. And yes, I said retard. I'm custom skull, bro. That looks dope as hell, man. I like that. Hood? Oh, we could put some freaking different hoods and toppers on. Ooh, that's kind of cool looking. I like that. Um, I'm going to do the chrome trim. And then, ooh. 
There's a deflector. What the fuck? I'm gonna do spotlights because I like that look, man. It looks cool. Yo, can we put can we put fucking police shit on this? That would be dope as hell. I'd love to. I'd love to do another police one. Does that say yo oh, backside? Gross. Um, cruising since seventy four. Okay. Why does that freaking light have to be right there? God damn it, man! It's always in the way. Um, golden honey panels. Oh, I like that cherry wood. The mahogany. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, we get some older looks here. I'm not comfortable with the barn find shit, but eh, whatever. Um, how do I feel about this? Um, kind of like the mahogany, but I kind of want to get rid of it though. That's if we can get rid of all the freaking wood, that'd be dope too. But I don't know. I'm thinking maybe the mahogany. I, I'm kind of digging the mahogany look. Um, moss prevention. Uh, mirrors. We got the old school mirrors, which is what I'd imagine goes on this thing. Retro mirrors are cool. The vintage, and then you got the bullet. Um, I'm gonna go with the, with the uh, retro mirrors because I like the retro plate. We're obviously gonna do yellow on black. Um, respray. I forgot. Um, roof lies. We're gonna we're gonna see what we got for the roof. Um, retro roof rack. You got the vintage roof rack. You got a freaking board. You got board two, board three, board four. Oh my god, there's fucking two boards. I don't I don't like that. Um, I'm just gonna do this one because I like the roof, the clear roof rack. Get some sun shades. Ooh, that's kind of cool looking. Imagine if you could turn this into the Ghostbusters van too. That'd be dope as hell, man. Uh, I'm kind of just digging the vintage Fulton. Oh, maybe that, actually. Yeah, I'm going to do that one because it matches the front there. Um, suspension. Uh, wow, we can just drop this thing. I am not a fan of that. Um, transmission. We're going to do race just to get it a little bit faster, you know. Try not to take flight. You try not to take this dip. Sorry. Defense mechanism. <laughs> This is supposedly a muscle. I'm just gonna fucking throw on a muscle, I guess, you know? I'm just gonna do the classic rod, you know? Um, tires, obviously bulletproof. And windows. Nah, I'm not gonna do black. I'm not gonna black them out, man. I don't need that shit. We're gonna go ahead and respray. We're gonna make this kind of work with the wooden look. Yo, that red pearl looks kind of dope. Huh. Yeah, I'm not digging any of these. Anyways, we're gonna go to metallic. Um, what color would a, a station wagon usually be, man? Well, I'd assume uh, like a nice blue for Ford products, but I don't. I don't know, man. Kind of like the blue on it, man. It looks nice, but I. I'll see what else we got here. I don't like the maple brown. That looks great, too. Um, we're going to go ahead and take a little bit of a look-see here. I don't want to... That gold looks kind of cool, too. I don't know. Anyways, um, <laughs> I'm going to go with a really uh, weird one here. I'm going to go the maple brown, man. It's a weird one. Um, yeah, that's, that's the color for that one. We're going to do the trim color now. Great. Ooh, that goes on the inside? Ooh. I'm going to do a bright orange just because it kind of matches the uh, wood, that wooden look. Yeah, that looks great, man. I, I love how that looks. Yeah. Looks very... Looks like it could be made out of wood, you know? Anyways. Oh, great. It's dark. So I'm going to have to drive it to either the casino or the garage. Freak off, Ron. <laughs> I'm so mean. Alright. Yeah, just based on the performance now, it feels so much better, actually. I don't know what it is. Whew. Well, the moon's going down relatively quick. It's already on that side. I already sold to you in the last video. You guys probably saw me do that in the last video, so hey, whatever. You guys 
times. You guys know I record these things back to back, so fuck it. Yeah, I literally gather up all the money that I'm going to use in a batch of video, in a batch of videos, and I literally just go out on a spending spree, buy all the cars, and then I customize them. But if you guys haven't seen a lot of my customizations, you'll probably see how back to back they really are. And you guys can see how tedious it can get, but you know what? I do it because it's fun to do. I actually really enjoy this. Actually enjoy customizing cars nowadays. It's better than being negative about all the other stuff that's in GTA. And you know my ass is playing six whenever it comes out. I'm I'm pretty sure they're focused on six. There we go. That's better for lighting purposes. But yeah, you guys can see the uh, looks here. I'm I'm kind of digging it. It's not anything crazy. I'm a big Ford guy, but this thing is kind of. Eh. Kind of wish there was customization on the wheel, the... Um, I'm gonna need a unsilenced gun. Yes, please run away. Thank you. They were just getting annoying. I'm sorry, now you guys gotta hear screaming for now. Um... Anyways, um, this is a nice Ford product, and I really like the original design on the Ford product, but you can't really replicate the full-on Ford because they don't want to get copyrighted. Um, but this is my version of it. It's very bronzy, very brown. It looks like it could be taken out of a creek, and this is how it came out, you know? But I don't know. I like the look. It's, it's very clean looking. It's just kind of... Eh. It, I, I would have chose a different color, but the the wooden part is just kind of hard to mix with, you know? It's very hard. Mom, this country... Stop talking on the phone when I'm recording, you assholes! And you dropped your cigarettes, you fucking idiot. Anyways... Um, how would I rate this thing? Um, I don't know. Um, I'd say it's a pretty solid 5 out of 5.8, maybe. It's, a, it's not great. It's not the best thing in the world. It is cool looking, but eh. There's so much more to it that I kind of wish would be a little different. I don't know. You guys, uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think about this vehicle and while you're down there hit that like button and subscribe i'd really appreciate a subscription and a like it, it kind of boosts my videos up on the algorithm man but i don't know this is a pretty quick one uh hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next video or live stream peace out you guys